Hello, dear students. Let us to discuss some MCQ questions on work power energy motion in two dimension and gravitation. So the question is a man of mass 65 kg is holding a bucket of mass 15 kg. He walks 50 meter on a level road at a constant speed of 3 meter per second. Remember, no work is done for here. Then he climbs up a hill of height 20 meter. What is the work done by the man? And you have to take acceleration due to gravity as ten. Okay, so here, so here you have to take the mass as 65 plus 15 that is 80 kg okay so the height is 20 meter okay so z is given 10 okay now here the work done is change in potential energy that is mgh. So here work done is equal to mgh. So mass is 80, g is 10 and this one is 20. So 8 into 2 is 16, 1, 2, 3 zeros. The unit is joule. Okay, so as per the question, option A is the correct one. Go for next one. Go for next question. A bullet fired a target penetrates 3 centimeter into the target what and its velocity reduced to 50 percent means half what is the total depth will the bullet penetrate before coming to rest so here you have to calculate the total penetration see in a given delay so here suppose the velocity is v naught after 3 cm its velocity is half after some distance its velocity is 0 so this distance is 3 this distance is x ok so remember throughout its motion the deacceleration is same or the force is same so now in first case you have to calculate the acceleration in second case the acceleration is same so we know that p square equal to u square plus 2 as so this implies acceleration a is equal to p square minus u square divided by 2 s okay so here the acceleration is one is v square v naught square okay final velocity is v naught by 2 it's a square is v naught square by 4 initial velocity is v naught square so whole divided by 2 into 3 that is 6 so therefore the acceleration is c so 4 okay v naught square minus 4 v naught square 3 v naught square 3 
P naught square minus divided by 4 and already 2 into 3 is 6 is there. So it means what? P naught square by 8 is the acceleration. Okay. So for second case, for second case, see, use S equal to P naught square by 2A. So for second case, so the final velocity is V naught by 2, uh, 0, 0 minus V naught square by 4 divided by V naught square upon 8. 2 means it is also V naught square by 2. So we are getting 1. Therefore, so the displacement here, the value of x is 1 and it is 3. So 3 plus 1 is 4. So therefore, b is the correct option. Okay, we we'll go for next question. Two bodies A and B, read it carefully. Two bodies A and B of masses 0 0.1. Okay, directly we take one as. 0 0.1, second one as 0 0.4 with velocities 200, we can call it as 200, so velocity of the second one is 100, okay, all are SI units only, huh? respectively, strikes a soft target, then, okay, so the uh, penetration okay hmm, a will penetrate more b will penetrate more so the question is uh, like this so first you have to calculate so the kinetic energy of the uh, first one is half m v square so penetration means change in kinetic energy so here half it is 0 0.1 into 200 square okay so 100 10 so so this one is you will get 2000 joule so the kinetic energy of the first one similarly for second one half mass is 0 0.4 velocity is 100 square so here it is 0 0.2, 0 0.2 into 100 is 20, 20 into 2 is 2000 Joule. See, here we are getting uh, both are same kinetic energy. Uh, so therefore, as per the option A and B, both penetrates to the same depth because both having same kinetic energy clear okay go for next question okay 